To the untrained eye, this couch or this bed may look ordinary, but they might be housing a creature with a blood-sucking secret no one wants to uncover. I'm talking about bed bugs. These brown flat oval creatures, which grow no bigger than an apple seed, are drastically showing up all over the country due to their resistance to common pesticides. After having vanished nearly 70 years ago, bed bugs have now made their way back into homes, hotels, and colleges across the U.S., hitchhiking from one infested area to clothing, luggages, and furniture. If you, say, uh, find some itchiness or red welts on your skin, then you probably have bed bugs. Chang Lu Wang is an entomology researcher studying the biology, behavior, and ecology of bed bugs, hoping to develop new and approved urban pest management technologies. The most common areas you can find bed bugs are the bed, sofa, where you would stay most of the time. Some um, investigation we found that at least 80% of the bed bugs are in the bed, sofa, and surrounding area. The exact cause of bed bug infestation is unknown. However, experts believe the reappearance of bed bugs is associated with the lack of effective pesticides, an increase in international traveling, and the lack of knowledge regarding control of bed bugs due to their prolonged absence. Uh, another way to um, identify infestation is try to look at your bed or the sofa, see if you can find um, the black or brown fecal spots that are uh, produced by the bed bugs. Uh, of course, you can also look for live bed bugs on the furniture. Depending on the level of infestation and the type of treatments being used, the price of extermination can range from $250 to $900 per room. Some suggestions on how to prevent bed bugs provided by the EPA are to reduce clutter to eliminate hiding places, use a protective mattress cover, wash and dry your clothes and sheets at high temperatures. When returning from trips, be sure to inspect your clothing and your luggage. Getting rid of bed bugs isn't easy, nor is it cheap. So the next time you want to hang out on the couch or prepare for bed, you may want to think twice about who else is joining you. For RETV, I'm Latifah Chambers. Thanks, Seed Sight, and don't let the bed bugs bite.